Question 34, we have inverse, converse, contrapositive, and original statement. Without knowing anything else, the original statement is S implies Q, so I can already write original statement right here on the first one. So that's the original. All right, as for the other ones, so what's happening in the second one, the order of Q and S is changing. What's happening in the third one, it's the same Q implies S, except they're negated. And the last one, the order changes and they're both negated. So let's look in the textbook. This is in chapter four and it's page 101. And here is, of course, the original, but here's the converse, inverse and contrapositive. So right here, you can answer the uh, question directly. Later on, you're gonna need a truth table for all of these at different times. And this truth table can help you out quite a bit. And one of the things to notice, the original implication and the contrapositive, which is reversed and negated, are logically equivalent. That may seem a bit strange, but if you turn it backwards and negate it, it's the same as the original. Uh, kind of like two wrongs make a right. It's kind of like that. If you negate something twice, uh, you get back to the original.